Hi guys, it's Alyssa from Planet Alyssa and I'm going to do something that I've done once before. I don't know how often I'm going to do this because um, they are kind of a big deal to put together. Um, but this is a video of all the things that I sold on Amazon in the past seven days. It, it's just about a full week. Um, I'm making this on Sunday uh, early afternoon and as of now this week I've sold $1,292 worth of stuff on Amazon, which is awesome. Um, potentially a few more sales could come in this afternoon or evening, but um, this gives you a pretty good idea of a week's worth of sales for me. Uh, as I mentioned in my goals video, I, I set a goal for myself of selling um, $800 gross sales uh, on Amazon per week, and um, I have exceeded that every week so far this year, so I'm very happy. Um, some weeks by, by quite a bit. And um, I've also set a goal or, or set a target for myself of sending in at least um, $1,200 worth of merchandise each week. Um, and that I've been meeting too and, and exceeding most weeks as well. But I wanted to make this video because um, it shows you the different things that sell on Amazon. And if you've watched some of my haul videos, you'll recognize some of the stuff that's here. Um, some of it I showed you not too long ago because Amazon's awesome. You can send stuff in and almost as soon as it gets checked into the warehouse, it is sold. So uh, pretty cool. Um, almost everything I'm going to show you is FBA, which means it's stuff that I've shipped to Amazon um, in big boxes and they have in turn shipped out to the customer. And the prices I will show you is the Amazon selling price. So there are fees that I have to pay on top of that. Um, and of course the price of purchasing the item and the cost of shipping it into Amazon as well need to be taken into account. A few of the things here are merchant fulfilled things. Um, most of the merchant fulfilled things are things that weren't worth it to send to Amazon but I could still make a few bucks on by shipping them out myself and uh, they're usually light and easy to ship items so um, I usually make a little bit of money on the shipping credit as well. I will try to get through this quickly. Here are the different items that I sold on Amazon this week. Uh, this is a Life is Good cell phone case. I sold two of these for $18.95. And this is a set, uh, it's called Table Talk Topics. I guess it's like a conversation starter thing. I sold for $14.99. There's a few more of these you'll see later. Um, this is Awkward Family Photos Game, which I sold for $15.30. It was new. And this was a new DVD I sold for $9.99. The DVD and the Awkward Family Photos came from thrift shops. Um, this is a Despicable Me hooded bath towel I sold for $11.99. This is some Baker's twine that I sold for $14.99, a whole package of it. And here's another one of these table topics that I sold for $15. I picked these all up on clearance at a store. And this is a book, used book, I sold for $13.99. This is one of those merchant fulfilled items. It's a mop head replacement I sold for $1.71. Uh, this is a Barbie Mega Block set I sold for $23.99. And this is a used book, uh, the BW Aero Engine, I sold for $44.99. This is a Hobbit journal, which is new. I sold for $11.62. Uh, the other table topic set, this one sold for $15. A locker chandelier I sold for $9.99. And this is a Jake and the Neverland Pirates uh, play set with a sword. It sold for $20. This is a uh, towel holder for the bathroom, sold for $24.99. This was a merchant fulfilled book only because I've had it forever and haven't gotten around to sending it off to Amazon. It sold for $18.96, it's the Goya Bean Book. Here is an infant bike helmet which sold for $17.24. You guys might remember this, this is that wax refill thing. Um, this package sold for $34.99. And also this tub of wax sold for $12.34. If you remember, I picked these all up for $5 in a set with some other stuff at a thrift store. This is an iPad case that I sold for $14.99. This is a router, a four port router, which sold for $40.99. 
This is a Graco crib sheet which sold for $8.23. About the least I would sell anything merchant or FBA on Amazon would be $7.99 because with the fees otherwise you're not making money. This is a Star Wars costume for a dog. It sold for $35. This one's a size medium and I happen to sell this FBA. I sold another one merchant fulfilled. I'll show you in a bit. This baby butler bottle holder set sold for $24.99. I picked it up not too long ago at a thrift store. And you might remember this candle, it's an anthropology candle. It sold for $19. I also picked this up at a thrift store. Uh, a locker shelf sold for $10.15. I sold a couple of these, I believe. This perfume sold for $9.17. It was a merchant fulfilled item because it's hazardous material and can't be shipped to the warehouse. This is a used book which sold for $10.45 called Nightmare Help. And this Bananagrams game sold for $13. This is something I picked up on clearance and sold a bunch of these mostly last week. This is a desktop missile launcher which sold for $27.99. And this is a Hello Kitty bike helmet which sold for $21.95. This is a multi-pack of treat sacks, which I sold for $14.99. It's something I didn't buy specifically for Amazon, but just kind of had and put together. And this Frankenstein book is new and sold for $20.95. And here's the other dog costume. I hadn't shipped this in because I figured no one would buy it until Halloween, but they proved me wrong. I sold this one for $17.99. And I sold three of these. It's a Spider-Man toy glove thing. They all sold for $12.99. And I sold this bike lock set for $11.45. This Power Rangers toy sold for $14.99. And I picked up this new Connect 4 game at a thrift store. It sold for $10.99. And this is a Little Miss Sunshine Lanyard that sold for $9.99. The picture on this item is awful. It sold for $11.60. It's a Simpsons uh, die-cast bus. These are a pair of boys' Nike gloves. They sold for $14.21. They're sports items, so that's how I'm able to sell them. These are Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles bath towels, a set of two for, for $20.99. And this is a Strawberry Shortcake headphone set. It sold for $34.99. The most expensive item I sold was this LED uh, marquee sign that sold for $59.99. You might recognize this latch hook kit I got at a thrift store. It sold for $11.73. And here's a lap desk which sold for $25.96. These are men's socks. They're Superman socks. They sold for $17.95. Again, they're a sports item, so that's how I'm able to sell them. And this puzzle sold for $11.75. It was a new puzzle. This hex bug set sold for $16.35. And this Nike ball pump sold for $22.65. This littlest pet shop uh, critter sold for $13.85. And these are some uh, Raiders headphones. They sold for $29.99. I sold these slippers for $9.99. Um, they didn't come up as a clothing item. I think health and beauty is what they were under. And this Harry Potter game, which was used, and you saw I picked up at the thrift store, was complete and sold for $17.99. Um, this is a quilt kit. It sold for $49.99. And these were pencil refills that sold for $9.29. I sold two of these uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle Chia Heads. They sold for $12.15. This Wolf Plush sold for $16. And the next uh, items are two merchant fulfilled items. This remote control, which I just bought and sold for $1.35 um, plus the shipping credit and some nail polish, which sold for $3.97. Thank you everyone for watching. Um, I generally put out videos each week on the different items I've sold on Etsy, although I guess once in a while I do these Amazon videos. And I put out other videos as well on selling online, mostly on Etsy, um, but also some stuff on Amazon and possibly eBay, although I don't do too much on eBay. 
Um, if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to subscribe to my channel, give it a thumbs up, share the video, or comment below. Uh, thank you guys for watching, and happy selling, everyone!